Okay, guys, thanks for joining us here in the charts. You tune into the Market Beast edition. It is your fellow compadre speaking, of course. As the title suggests, we found a stock that has broken out. I'm going to prove to you that it is something that we actually predicted back in December. And if you guys are just joining us, welcome in. Hit that subscribe button. We'd love for you to join us. Let me know that you just subscribe so that I can personally welcome you into the charts. Thank you for joining us here. We appreciate that. This engagement pr promotes the channel and the YouTube algorithm picks up on it, that guy. So thank you for your support with that, including our loyal subscribers. Let's get into this chart. It's Netflix, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and dive. Uh, I also have an interesting pattern that I want to show you here. So yeah, let's just get into that. Let's dive right into the charts here, shall we? All right, so today is January the 20th, 2021, and the previous close of Netflix is going to be $501.77. It's up about 0.7% for the day, ticker symbols NFLX. Uh, looks like the pre-market, there's some buying interest coming in, $572.60, up about 14.1% for the pre-market there, okay? All right, so here's the pattern that I've been following. We also have a price target, so stick around to the end for that. And guys, let me just be very transparent with you all before we even get started, because a lot of people just look at the thumbnail and just think it's time to buy. Hit that buy button. We played this market from about 518. Let me just show you the video that we posted. Uh, December the 16th, 2020. We're not going to listen in, uh, but it's 500. It says, will this stock break through $550? At the time of the video, it was 518. We were entering the market at that time. We have exited this market, okay? At 500, I think it was like $40 or something like that. We're not investing in this. So hopefully you all, we're, we're clear about that, okay? We're not in this market. We're done, okay? So uh, yeah, let's hopefully we're, we're, we're clear about that. So let's go ahead and proceed here. Here's the pattern that I found here, guys. And it's uh, pretty simple, I think. That's it. Really simple. Uh, this is called a symmetrical triangle. Just kind of broke up within this range here at, uh, let's see, June 2000 and June 16th, 2020. Just kind of co perfectly confined within this range. Of course, this is going to be considered consolidation before the breakout. It looks like the price is breaking out to the upside. That could change, of course. Uh, but let's see here. The uh, price is, uh, of course, the way that you measure the target on a symmetrical triangle is you just basically you take the uh, the point of entry, the lower level that the, that's considered the support line down here, and then you measure it all the way to the top, the uh, the resistance line in the beginning of the pattern. I could be wrong about that. Correct me down in the comment section, guys, if I'm getting this wrong. And then you just kind of take your little handy dandy trend line there, and then you just kind of measure the top to the bottom, the support and resistance line that I just pointed out. And then you just kind of put it on the breakout right there. And that's going to give us a price target right here at this green line that I've already put on the chart. And it's going to be $662-ish, okay? So for those of you who are just looking for the price target, and again, guys, please do not take this. It sucks I have to say this. Do not take this as financial advice and enter this market and do not hold yourself accountable if you uh, don't assess your risk tolerance before you enter this market, Okay. Just have to put that out there. Sucks I have to say that, but yeah, that's that. Uh, so that's what we're looking at. That's the price target overhead from a technical standpoint. We're not gonna, we're not entering this market again. We're done with this. Okay, I think I said that a few times. Um, so, but that is the technical target overhead. Uh, Netflix is in an overall uptrend. It's in a very beautiful uptrend, very aggressive as well. I think dated all the way back to uh, 2003 as far as the technical data showing me that could be off uh, sub double digits is when it actually started out around that time. So obviously it's gone up significantly. So if you actually participated at those levels, let me down, know down in the comment section if you guys have been holding ever since then. Good job. You know, congratulations to you if you uh, held strong on Netflix, you're uh, up on your position there. So that's what I wanted to stop and let you guys know. Is it too late to buy? Obviously, the title suggests is it too late to buy. Again, you have to assess your risk tolerance. Um, what what we do over what we do go over on this channel is support and resistance. The previous level of resistance can be located here at about five hundred and twenty four dollars. So as long as the price can stay above that level, then I don't see why it would be a challenge for this uh, instrument to uh, make it to the overhead target, the technical target overhead. So. Yeah, again, you have to understand how you're going to enter this market, exit this market, assess your risk. So as far as it too late to buy, that's a question you have to answer yourself, guys. But it has it appears that it has officially broken out to the upside. Again, that can change. This asset is very volatile. Can it just kind of break down below? No, that is possible. Just be prepared. Have a strategy. Execute your strategy, okay? 
And um, yeah, just that's pretty much it, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Leave me an appropriate thumb just below the video there if you enjoyed the content. Uh, leave a comment down below. Again, let me know if you guys have entered this market, if you caught our video. Excuse me, and thank you to you all. Um, there, we didn't get we, we got a lot of views on there 344 it's a lot to me guys we got seven thumbs up thank every single one of you did we get any comments yeah everyone if you see your name there on the screen thank every single one of you guys i truly appreciate your engagement like when you guys engage with the with us on this channel guys because you don't have to do that and i, and I do appreciate that so i think we covered everything let's cut out here guys um before you guys go if you're new we also cover the alternative markets we cover bitcoin and altcoins if you guys are into that so of course subscribe hit the bell so we can send you out those notifications as soon as that information is readily available and that's it guys um take care of yourselves hopefully you enjoyed that hopefully you guys are doing well uh protect your portfolios uh we're going to talk very soon and bye for now